Wednesday night in Salt Lake City here at Ute Field, a good one for the University of Utah. They had struggled coming in tonight, scoring goals. That was not the case on this Wednesday night against in-state foe. Utah Valley, they got the scoring going early tonight. Kelly Bullock with a great hustle play, stick to The ball comes deflecting out. Bullock stays with it, makes one pass, makes one move, and fires it to the back of the net to make it 1-0 Utah. And that was just the beginning tonight. Then Utah played defense and made the turn and played on the counterattack. Schonauer looking ahead to Kafusi. Taliana takes a touch and fires it past the keeper to make it 2-0 Utah, 16 minutes in. Then the same player, Schonauer, picks up her head, and there's Kayla Jennings. Jennings takes a touch and another rounds the keeper and finds the back of the net before the defender gets there to make it 3-0, and that's where we stood at halftime. In the second half, Utah continued on the front foot with the attack. Kafusi on the attack, 1v3, gets pulled down. A red card shown to Bushman. Penalty kick opportunity. The captain, Courtney Brown, roofs it for goal number four. And Utah's route is on. And this was the capper on Wednesday night. Look at the run by Standish. Nobody closes down the ball. She rounds the defender, takes one more touch, and beats the keeper far post. That made it 5 nothing. 80 minutes in, and that was the final score at Ute Field. Shots on goal were pretty even. Corner kicks were all UVU, but the saves and the opportunities were taken advantage of by the University of Utah. Bullock, Kafusi, Jennings, Brown, and Standish all with goals, and the Utes win with a clean sheet tonight for their keeper, Casey Wardle, by a final score of 5 to nothing. Utah improves to three wins on the season. They'll be back in action in Southern California against Cal State Fullerton coming up on Saturday. Once again, our final score on a Wednesday night from Ute Field, Utah 5 and Utah Valley nothing.